So today, I've got to just do a piece of work at Moulton Gallops for Adrian Keithley. You know, it's actually probably about just a five minute trip over town, really. So there's obviously two training centres in Yorkshire, obviously Moulton, where I live, and then there's Midland. You've got everything in such close proximity to everything. Definitely riding in, in the north, some beautiful views kind of makes you appreciate what an amazing county we live in. Don't they call it God's own country? So we're just pulling up here. Hi, how are you? Oh, very good. <laughs> I'm born and bred in Yorkshire. Everyone's a lot more friendlier. Yards in Moulton are a lot more spread out and you're not on top of each other, whereas, you know, the likes of Newmarket and Lambourne, you're next door to each other. Yeah. Yorkshire is, you know, an up and coming, thriving community, really. There's Nine race courses in Yorkshire, 87 trainers. You know, living around here, you've got so many race courses in such close proximity. So the Yorkshire Summer Festival is a week in, in summer where you're at a, a Yorkshire race course each day. It is a good week to look forward to. And what's quite good, they put a few competition-y things on. I mean, like, you have that paddock and chips, which is the football before the first race, and then obviously they've got the jockeys' championship. Just now, we've just been at Moulton Gallops at the Six Furlong, um, just did a piece of work there. On to my granddad's now. Uh, we'll just put this tack back and then on the road. To another part of Yorkshire. So my granddad is the one and only Mick Easterby. We're split between two yards, so I'll head to our top yard first. They do actually tack them up for me, which makes my life a little bit easier. Come on, Sarah. Mm. Yeah, nice and settled. So now we're off to our other yard, the bottom yard. So life for me isn't as easy because I do have to tack them up. <laughs> up here or down there? I've just finished riding out there. So yeah, no, just on our way back to Moulton. What's brilliant about Moulton as well, we have um, the Jack Berry House as well. The centre's a bit like Lambeau. And now we've, we've got the Indie Jockeys Fund Jack Berry House, which, you know, is amazing. So uh, this is the hydrotherapy pool. And this was one of the main places that I came when I did my back because I couldn't have any impact, so I couldn't do any running or anything. So this actually has a running machine in the bottom. So it's brilliant for getting those muscles back working without having to put too much strength on, so amazing. And this end room is the exerciser room, which is also brilliant for, um, you know, young and upcoming apprentices coming through. There's a lot of coaches come and have lessons on them. So there's two here and one here in front of a TV screen. Um, so you can, you know, project a race and, and pretend like you're, you're riding a race. So, you know, it is again, very good for fitness. It's quite good for swapping kind of the stick between your right and your left. So we're just leaving the Jack Berry house now. Now I'm just gonna head home, um, grab a quick shower and get changed for racing and then we're gonna head off, head off to York. Heading on our way to York Racecourse. Yeah, we've got one ride there today on a horse called Late Arrival, actually for my grand and my uncle, so you, know, you should have a, a good chance, but we'll get there get sorted, changed and have a little walk out onto the track and, and go from there just to have a look at the ground and whatnot. So we've just come into the girls changing room. So this is my area, my valets 
has my bag, so he's washed all my stuff from the day before. So what I'll do now is get changed and we'll go for a little wander out onto the track. Good grass coverage. They always do a very good job of the ground, really. So I've now got the track, you know, got a feel of the ground and everything. So I'm going to go back into the changing room and get ready to race. So the Yorkshire Summer Festival, it brings like a sense of community and it just really showcases how good racing in Yorkshire is. So across the nine race courses that we have here in Yorkshire, what do we say it was 900,000 race goers attend. We want to show that actually up in Yorkshire, we are just as good as the South and, you know, a very good racing community and we want, you know, everyone to come and visit. Well, it is beautiful ground, but my horse likes it like a road, so the quicker the better for me. I can quicken on quick ground and I couldn't today, so not our day today, but hopefully, you know, they might drop them a couple and, you know, we'll have our day again, hopefully.